So in this video, we're going to see what are lambda functions, okay? Lambda functions in Python are, let us say, uh, functions which are quite anonymous, okay? By anonymous, what do I mean is, it's just like a one-line function. So uh, you don't have to formally say def and then give it a function name and then give it the number of arguments it takes, you know? You don't have to write all that code. It's just a small block of an operation that you need to quickly do it and uh, That's it. So why would you want to create a full-blown? Function when you can do it in a very short way. So that is why lambda functions are called as anonymous functions You can just make it once and use it like n number of times that you want So if you look at here, this is the syntax of lambda function you have the keyword lambda and then after a space what follows are a sequence of arguments okay there's no restrictions of how many arguments that you can have but you can definitely have one and more than one and then you have a colon and then you put in whatever expression that you want to put now in this example at line number seven i'm trying to create a replica of a formula called as a plus b the whole square so i'm trying to make a square plus b square plus 2ab so and then i'm going to make use of f and when i say f of 3 comma 4 uh, it's more like saying the value of a is going to be 3 and the value of 4 is b is going to be 4 so it's like 3 plus 4 the whole square so I'm making it as a mathematical function, which is going to be f of 3 comma 4. So this way it looks neat, okay? Any mathematical formula can be used with the help of lambda and make it look like a mathematical expression. So this is the power of uh, lambda. So f of 3 comma 4, you take in the value, a and b act like the parameters, 3 is A, 4 is B, and then you do this function right here and it re returns you the result. The best part is, lambda expressions can be used inside of another function as well. So, uh, you will really start appreciating the uh, power of lambda when you are trying to simplify complicated formulas. So, let's say that you want to have uh, an integration formula and you have to do it in a really short way definitely you can make use of lambdas so mathematically speaking if you're trying to solve any mathematical equations or formulas you know quickly if you want to do something inside of a function you can create a lambda expression and keep on using that so this is the power of lambda expression now let's try to uh, run the code and verify our output so there you go. So 3 plus 4 the whole square, what you get is 49. So you can add up a number of expressions, you can tweak it to your wish. This is what Lambda gives you, a very short, concise function. Thank you.